what's up everyone i'm Ozap. in your video i really miss doing these tutorials with shitty quality and angle cameras but here we back today guys i'm going to show you how to make a homemade handbrake it is very easy to make and it's useful for drifting in the first tutorial i aim it to make sequential shifter and handbrake at the same time today we're gonna aim for one thing the handbrake what materials do we need to make this thing? We need a glue gun, USB controller, rubber band, cardboard stick that I made in the previous tutorial and the last thing, small medicine bottle, I will show you later what we need it for. While we are talking, I left the glue gun connected to the electricity to warm up. And I think it's ready, let me check it. Yeah, that's hot, it's time to work. First thing to do is getting that cardboard stick and the glue gun. Put the glue inside the stick and a little bit around it. After that, put the stick in the analog but put it tilted towards you. I mean by that the stick tilted backwards so you can reach it easily while drifting. Always check if it's not tilted to the left or to the right. I choose the cardboard stick because the weight of it is good for the analog. If you put heavy stick on the analog you will end up breaking the analog. When you finish, leave the glue to cool down so it gets solid, maybe for 30 minutes or 15 minutes. So the next step is putting the rubber band around the analog and make it tilted forward so the cardboard stick will be almost in the center. Okay, let's test it out. For one rubber band, that's solid and quick to be honest. So before the final step, we're gonna add the magic touch, the small medicine bottle. We're gonna put it on top of the handbrake to close the hole. Also, you can adjust the height of your handbrake and be careful. Always hold your handbrake stick while squeezing the bottle. The final step is testing the homemade handbrake for a couple days and I'll be back with the result. Welcome back guys, the result is very good, the handbrake works perfectly in all the games. Just to let you know, I added another rubber band, the same size as the other one, to make it a little bit solid. If you make it too solid, the handbrake stick will detach from the analog. I'll drop my handbrake settings at the end of this video. Trust me guys, if you can make something, no need to buy it. If this tutorial or the old one helped you, make sure you drop a like to make this video to go up. Share it with your friends, comment what you think and hit that subscribe and bell button so you don't miss out anything. Thanks for watching, see you in the next video. Peace.